So tell me about this tattoo shop. It is in, uh, on the website, it says that it is an all uh, women run tattoo shop. How did it start? It started with um, me and uh, who is now my wife, Mona. She was in a, another tattoo shop in the area and um, just wanted to make a change. And I had always wanted to um, start a business, number one, but also have something that was art related. I, I thought maybe, um, you know, uh, art in, in, a, in a bar, you know, it was like a gallery slash bar thing or, you know, I don't know. I was just trying like to come up with- Like own a bar? You wanted to own a bar and then have art in it? Yeah, for a minute. Yeah. I dig that. Okay. Yeah. I know what you're yeah. saying. You'd probably be into it. It was like a whole, it was going to be a whole like retro board game kind of um, oh, thing. Yeah. But uh, yeah, but that's probably good because I, I would have been up too late and I probably would have become an alcoholic. And so it was just no good. No good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so um, yeah, she wanted to make a change and it was like um, tattoos and um, you know, art on your skin and art on your walls totally makes sense. So, um, we just decided to take the plunge and, and, and start up. Yeah. Um, at the time it was just me and her and we had one other girl lined up and that was it. And now there are six of us there. Okay. Which is pretty amazing. So how long ago was that? Did you say? Uh, it was just, uh, it'll be five years in May. Wow. That's fantastic. Wow. Yeah. And you had never run a business before. No. Oh, wow. Okay. There's hope for us yet. I love there that. Yes, yes. <laughs> I've kind of, uh, like all my previous work um, situations, I think have kind of led me to this. Uh, I worked for a contractor for a little while. I was supposed to be doing interior design and things kind of took a turn and I ended up having to teach myself QuickBooks to help him stay afloat. And yeah. so I think, you know, partially that is partially just you know, luck and I don't know. It's, it's crazy how it worked out. Had you it's ever crazy. tattooed before? No. Okay. And so like who apprenticed you or like, how did that come yeah. about? Like, <laughs> I kept, um, I kept going back and forth as to whether I would start to tattoo. Um, I have a super, um, fear of needles to be quite honest with you. I'm with you on that one. <laughs> I, um, yeah, I cannot go to the doctor. Like it's just no. not cool. Uh -uh. It's not a good situation. So, um, yeah, I was like, there's no way I'm going to be able to tattoo. Like how could I possibly do that when I can't look at a shot going in my arm or uh -huh. anything like that? And, um, but I'd always been into art. And so I thought, well, I don't know. After a long time, I thought, well, I'll try it. And, Mona was the one who taught how to, and um, it's it's totally different mindset for some reason. I know it doesn't make sense to people that don't have this weird phobia, but tattooing and doctors' needles are completely different in my brain. <laughs> I want to say it's because it's a mechanism and makes a sound. Um, I could see that. Um, I don't want it done to me, 